Steinbach. We're with the Wild Side Customs. This is my buddy David Yoakum, and we're from Jasper, Georgia. So yeah, we brought our Godzilla truck, and this is our first time we're really enjoying it. Well, it started out as a 67 F100. We came up with the Godzilla theme, ordered it from Mass Motorsports. David kind of had the idea of where we kind of took the truck and ran with it. We put the Godzilla 7.3, about 600 horsepower. It's got a cam and a tune in it. Put a TKX five-speed manual transmission behind it. Of course, nine-inch forward, limited slip, four-link rear, Crown Vic front, uh, four-wheel uh, four disc brakes, and um, all four corners we put the uh, ride coilovers, ride-tech coilovers. Rides good, stops good, handles good, and goes good. I mean, it's, to me, it's just like an LS. It's so easy to make power with, fun to drive. I mean, it's, you know, I like it. We actually bought the truck with this green, so we we don't know exactly what the color is. It's been very a uh, hot topic with people, but it just kind of worked out with the Godzilla, kind of a green monster, that's what this is. So it just kind of all worked together. Dave came up with the color combinations because we had to get the wheels, and you know, things hard to find right now. We ordered these wheels as a second choice because the other ones we wanted didn't come in in time. So then he color matched the paint. We kind of did the accents on the truck and it just really worked out really, really well. We got the Holly system on it. Um, when we bought it from Mass Motorsports, it took them about eight or nine months to get it to us. So they're using the Holly um, Terminator and uh, they've got their, their system to wire, but it runs really good. They put their cam in it um, and springs, but uh, the, the Holly system seems to be really good. It's nice and clean. You don't have a lot of you know parts or anything. The brain we put under the dash inside, so it's a really clean look. And we're really proud of, of the way David, you know, kind of kept the engine bay really clean and subtle. I'm a Ford guy, he's kind of a Chevy guy, so it's kind of best of both worlds with the push rod engine. We really think it's gonna take off, and we just kind of wanted to get out front with a lot of other people and, and just see what we could do and, and ride the wave.